Hey, Ange. Hey, Angela. Hey, Angela. Hey, Angela. Hey, Ange. Okay. Hey, Angela. Angela. Hey, Angela. Hey, Angela. Hey, Ange. Hey, Ange. First of all, just want to say congratulations. You have officially survived the most grueling job on campus. So, I think one thing a lot of people don't realize about me and Angela's relationship is that not only is she the president uh, right before me, but she was also my predecessor when I became the EVP. And so I've had, uh, this will be my, my second year of following in her footsteps, which is uh, no easy task. I'd say regardless of Angela's official titles, um, one of the best qualities that she has is wanting to get to know as many people as possible and really talking to everyone in the Hanson community. Um, She's helped people find their niche at Hanson, really, you know, contribute what they're passionate about and what they're interested in to the Hanson community. And I think that's her biggest quality, and that has been her biggest quality as president. One of my favorite moments with her is when she sat Jillian and I down and asked us what we were planning on doing in the future and helped us make our decision to run for secretary or run for an office in the first place. I know there's been a lot of times where, especially this year, like first semester, I've been, you know, feeling down, and then Angela will come up and be like, hey, what's wrong, though, and we'll talk about it, and I know we've done a lot of that, vice versa, so it's it's been nice to also have a person who, who I know is leading the college, but who's also, like, willing to, like, sit down one-on-one -on -one with people and be like, hey, how's it going, like, it's all going to be okay, that kind of thing, so uh, thanks for that, too. So one of my favorite memories of Angela is that when we were first chosen as RAs she, um, at Hanson, she was so outgoing and welcoming to us that she, when she would see me on campus, she would always say hi and make sure to um, just make me feel really at home at Hanson. And I feel like that is really your legacy at Hanson, is that you wanted everybody to feel at home. No. I know from the essay perspective, like president is not easy, and you've taken a lot of hard, difficult, made and made a lot of hard, difficult choices. Which I think is also another big um, point of your presidency that is really hard to do. Um, so I would say that Angela has probably been the most dynamic member of the president's group. She's definitely the one who I think has kept us together the most, and has really been the glue for the group. She has such a dynamic personality that everyone can relate to, and so regardless of what's going on, a stressful meeting, a fun meeting, she's always the voice that kind of brings us back down to earth. Multiple great things that Angela has done as president are, first of all, Angela brought music to Cabinet. That you made Cabinet fun, fun to come around. I don't know any other presidents that can say that. She always had her little speakers and was always playing music according to the theme, and she dressed up every single week and even told Elena and I, Elena's the CJ and I'm the senator, that we had to dress up. Uh, you know me, I've never been one to, to embrace the themes of cabinet, but you're just the polar opposite in, in such a good way. And uh, everyone really appreciated that. Um, and it made everyone feel really comfortable being themselves at cabinet and, uh, and really being able to, to share their opinions um, when you're making it uh, such an open time for everyone. So uh, another thing about Angela that I, that I really admired about her and that I hope to hopefully bring in in my presidency is how transparent she was about issues with the college. Um, and so for this video I was just trying to come up with like maybe particular instances where as vice president me and her like had some discussion behind closed doors that I could tell you a fun story about. But truth is there aren't very many of those because pretty much everything we ever talked about she brought to the college. Um, and I think that that's really really awesome that uh, there, there's no like secrecy in, in the way she ran the government. She wanted to make sure uh, everyone was clear about what was going on and that everyone had their, their chance to, to put in their opinion. Um, and that's something really, really respectable and that uh, hopefully we can continue in Hanson for years to come. Uh, Angela, you've done an awesome job this year. Being president is not easy, um, but your service to Hanson will never be forgotten. Um, and I think I even want to go back to a year ago to also say awesome job with the BMP. Uh, you took that project on and you did a wonderful job um, and you just kept doing an even better job as president. Your leadership and ability to bring groups together have been remarkable and 
were very pleased just to have been around you and to have enjoyed meeting with you every week. And you took the, the lead university-wide and you've been out front pushing for a course on human sexuality and I think that's great. It's good to see the students um, ahead on an issue and, and your leadership there has been really important. One of my favorite things about Angela is how animated she is during uh, story time with Angela. If you haven't heard a story by Angela, you should ask her to tell you one before she graduates because they are the best. Um, I'll really miss your stories and your laugh and your impression of your mother and dad. Like her accents and interpretations of how people talk, especially when she imitates her parents. I think that's really funny. It just gives her this magical ability to make anyone laugh. It's the last goodbye. Uh, so Ange, thank you again for, for doing everything for the college this year. Uh, it's, been, it's been a stellar year. Uh, we've, we've been through a lot as a, as a college and I think you've done uh, a really tremendous job guiding everyone through this. Um, I know we'll be friends for a long time uh, and good luck with everything as you kind of finally transition out of this role into uh, bigger and better things. And Angela, we know you'll do great at Deloitte and we're looking forward to hearing from you and keeping in touch with you on everything you're doing and we hope you have a really successful future. And stay in touch. Thank you, Angela, for everything that you've done for me, for my classmates, um, for the college in general. Uh, we're going to miss not seeing your face around um, or hearing your beautiful laugh. Um, and I'm not going to be able to say, Angela, anymore. Yeah. Good luck, Angela. I know you're going to do great in anything that you do. Um, you're pretty high energy. Um, you're a very smart person. and. Um, um, you can just tell that you're going to succeed in whatever it is that you, you set your mind to do and you're going to succeed. So uh, we're going to miss you. Um, it's not going to be the same without you. Um, but, you know, you got to take that next step. So good luck. Thank you, Angela, so much for everything that you do for Hanson. And you're going to have an amazing future. I love you. Mwah. You know, thanks for everything you've done. I'm really going to miss you. Um, but we'll both be in Houston, so we're going to have to hang out. So. Love you, Ange. We will miss you, and we wish you well for the future, and we do help you, hope you keep in contact with us. Thanks for everything you've done, Angela, and good luck with life after Hanson. So uh, all that being said, Angela, I just want to thank you for your service to Hanson College. Uh, we've all really, really appreciated it, and it's been a really fun ride. So uh, best of luck in your future endeavors at Deloitte and beyond, and uh, thanks again for everything. Thank you, Angela. I've enjoyed our presidency so much. This has been a ton of fun. Um, but more so, like, this isn't a goodbye by any means. I'm really excited to continue our friendship and keep hanging out and doing great things in our own respects and coming back to talk about it. So, Yeah. This is definitely not goodbye. You guys are leaving me. All of you are leaving me for a year. But yeah, you guys better come back through beer pick and we better be invited to your wedding. <laughs> and now senior year, trying to find our career paths and being president and CJ together. I wouldn't have done it with anyone else. I'm so glad that I got to do it with you. And thank you. Um, you've been a great president and I'm proud to have stood by your side this whole time and to call you my roommate and my best friend.